Hey everybody, Ann here. Already done chicken tours. Just having my coffee right now. Got a fire going because it's chilly this morning. Look at, look at, I'm wearing my new Snuggie, I think they call them. Um, neighbor Selena gave it to me for Christmas. Oh, I just love these things. Now I can have one to wear while I wash the other one. <laughs> I don't get to wash that one very often because I just, I don't want it to like hang dry for two days until I can wear it again. And now I have to. Anyway, uh, before we get started, uh, I want to show you a couple things that happened last night. Okay, just gonna peek in here. Oh, all three of them up on the roost. Hooray. I was so relieved when I went out there and those three chickens, well, two hens and a rooster, were up there on the roost. They figured it out, they look happy. And I went out and checked them this morning, and they are doing absolutely great. I'll show you them a little bit later on. I don't know, maybe one more day in this coop, and I'll think they'll be good. And now for the delivery. I bought myself a Prezi. They delivered it. I cannot believe it actually got here today. It's in this box, and that right there wasn't... I did that damage because I couldn't peel the label off and I didn't want to show it and you guys see my address. So I'm just going to open this up and show you what's inside. I'm thinking the easiest way so I don't have to destroy the box in case there's anything wrong is just to kind of split this and then open it up that way. See, it's a laptop box. <laughs> Turn it over. Let's see if I can open this baby up. Let's see what's inside. Oh, it's my pretty laptop. Okay, questions, problems, please call us. Now, y'all, I ordered this two and a half days ago, and it's already here. I cannot believe it. It is a renewed computer, so it's not brand new. Got it off Amazon. It was just a little bit over a couple hundred bucks, and it had everything that I needed except for a DVD player, and I've ordered a separate one of those because... The good price with this, I could afford it. It's got the power supply, and it is really well packed. All right, let me get this all taken apart. Oh, gosh, this is special bubble wrap. Oh, my goodness. There's the power supply. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how well this charges up and how the, the battery works. They give you instructions here. Creating a recovery USB drive for Windows 10. Yeah, I know how to do all that. I'll probably end up loading it up with Linux anyhow. So, uh, great. Looks good. Look at that beautiful thing. Right away, it looks like there is absolutely zero flaws on it and it's so shiny and pretty let's turn it over see what it looks like on the underside there is a little scratch but you would expect that with a renewed computer but and that's on the underside just look at how beautiful it looks it is absolutely stunningly clean look at that there's no hairs in it like things get around here with all my dog hairs beautiful all right let's open this up and see what it looks like oh my gosh i i opened it up and check this out it's got a backlit keyboard and it just it's coming on right away it's got a protective plastic cover over the top of this um yeah it just comes off look at it. it's the simple things in life that they do. So they protected the screen. This has an anti-glare screen, but look at the pristine look of this computer. It looks like a brand new computer to me. Oh, this is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So it's going to go through the boot up thing. I probably should plug it in because I don't know how much battery life it has. Oh my gosh, there's, there's not a scratch on it except for on the underneath side beautiful okay well let's get this thing booted up and see how it goes this is going swimmingly i am so stoked about this keyboard every time you touch it you can't see it because i got a flashlight on you know on this backlit keyboard it has one of these things but i'm not going to use it i like to use mouse i don't even like the touchpad uh 
but this one is kind of slick. It's got these two buttons here, these two buttons here. So I don't know. Maybe I can get used to using a touchpad. I like a mouse instead. Okay, so it's going to do a bunch of update stuff, and it's probably going to take forever. Uh, but that's okay. Doesn't that look pretty? It sure does. Hi. We're getting everything ready for you. Thank you. Okay, it's all set up now, and it is working great. I'm just going to go and remove a bunch of stuff that I don't want. Probably uninstall a bunch of programs. I don't like Microsoft Edge. Yeah, get rid of a bunch of stuff. And I'm going to be able to start using this to edit videos and work on my recipe book and watch movies once I get my external DVD drive. And this is great. It's been a long time since I used Windows. But, yeah, this is how I remember it. <laughs> I don't really like Windows. I'll probably put Linux on it, like I said. But I got me a laptop, and it is smooth as heck. I've been going around, clicking on stuff. Oh, I have to double click click that there we go microsoft casual games i love some of these games on here cool and everything is working absolutely perfectly the battery is charging it came half charged so i got me a new laptop you guys hmm cortana terminate you know what why is the uninstall button grayed out it's not clickable Huh. I'm going to have to look into that because I don't use Cortana. I don't want Cortana. The only downside to this particular computer is it only has 197 gigabytes free of a 237 gigabyte hard drive. So I'm looking into getting an external hard drive. I think I have one somewhere. It might be half a terabyte, might be a terabyte. Not sure. I need to find it though. But um, I know they sell them on Amazon. So I'm going to be looking into that. I've got it pretty much set up the way that I want it. And you'll notice there's not a like a picture up here. Um, I may add some photos of my family. But the last thing I want when I open up my computer is to be bombarded with a ton of icons all over the place. When they are already very nicely organized over here. And there was a bunch of garbage up here. I don't use any of it. So... I'm always getting into my settings, my photos, my email, use WordPad a lot, uh, the command prompt, control panel, calculator, paint. Oh, I love Microsoft Paint. Windio, Windows Media Player. There's a few more things I may be able to set up in here. But other than that, this is it, you guys. And I've uninstalled a lot. I couldn't figure out how to uninstall Cortana, but I have disabled it. Um, I uninstalled Internet Explorer. It wouldn't let me take out Microsoft Edge, but I removed it from uh, like a default program. Uh, and that was kind of hard to figure out too. Um, I can't use a DuckDuckGo browser on a Windows PC, but the next best thing was Opera for me um, for privacy reasons. So I'm using the Opera browser and I've just got email WordPad and Opera up here. I like to keep it simple and I like to keep it green. I feel like I got a good deal on this computer. It has Bluetooth. It's uh, Wi-Fi is fast. I just transferred a bunch of files via Bluetooth and it went spectacularly fast and it works great for a little bit. You know, it was like around 250 or something like that. Um, it's a great computer. It's a Hewitt Packard EliteBook 840 G3 business laptop, 14 inch screen, and it's got all this other stuff in it. You can pause the video and read the specs for yourself. I ordered it off Amazon and the seller is IT Replay, all one word, IT Replay. And I don't think the version that I have is available anymore, but it's worth looking into renewed laptops because this one, it's been a very good experience. I got to tell you, this seller, uh, I put my order in and they had it shipped by the end of the day. That is awesome. So I'm very happy with this computer. I dig it. Anyhow, I got to get up and do something. I'm making fire starters right now. 
and uh, I need to go look at the chickens again. And I think this video is long enough, so that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.